Welcome back to another episode of Dragon Age 2. We are turning into High Town at night for the sake of a. Well, let's see if we can find it. There's going to be a duel happening. Fools rush in. Let's get involved in something we should have nothing to do with and see what it takes us. Lost my cursor for a second. Wow, this really got out of hand, didn't it? What was that screaming? Well, that was something. Where's Isabella? Did you even help? There you are. I've been here for hours. Ada hasn't shown up. No one has. I don't like this. I don't like this? <laughs> That's right up there with what could possibly go wrong. That's the wench we're looking for. Got her. Oh, well, here we go again. I guess the other group was just a sort of chance encounter. This person over there just watching. Hader sent them. Search the bodies. I need to find out where he is. Hiding in the chantry and sending thugs to finish me off. Coward. He'll not get away with this. Come on. I forgot to dump my vendor junk again. Crap. What's wrong with me? Well, Hawk is down. This is going badly. It already went badly. <laughs> Isabella, should have known you'd find me here. Tell your men to burn the letters next time. Castillon was heartbroken when he heard about the shipwreck. You should have let him know you survived. It must have slipped my mind. <laughs> Where's the relic? I lost it. Castillon's just going to have to do without. Lost it? Just like you lost a ship full of valuable cargo? They weren't cargo, Hader. They were people. Those slaves were worth a hundred sovereigns a head. And you let them scurry off into the wilds. And now the relic's gone, too. Castillon won't be happy to hear that. I promise you. Will someone explain what's going on? Isabella's been a very bad girl. 
ruined a perfect business deal, and then ran away. She didn't tell you? I told her enough. I said I arranged for a duel, which I did. I also said you wouldn't play fair, which you didn't. We can talk later if you want. Right now, we have other problems. Your threats end here. Castillon won't hear about me from Hader, but he'll find me eventually. I just have to get him the relic. Simple as that. What's so interesting about the relic? I don't really know what it is, except that it's ancient and worth my weight in gold. Castillon has me chasing it down as payback for freeing his slaves. <sighs> to be honest, I think he just wants me dead. But that would be letting me off easy. You hired Lucky to track down information on the relic. That's right. He insisted he knew everything that was going on in Kirkwall. He lied. <laughs> I bet he doesn't even know everything going on in his pants. Did you end up in Kirkwall because your ship was destroyed? There was a storm. The ship ran aground on the reefs near the city. I managed to make it to shore. Most of my men weren't as lucky. Poor sods. I knew some of those men almost ten years. Oh, balls. Who is Castillon? He's a powerful merchant based in Antiva. I believe he has ties to the Felicissima Armada. I used to work for him. The jobs mostly involved smuggling lyrium, jewels, or the occasional criminal acquaintance. He paid well. What's this about you freeing slaves? I was asked to escort Castillon's cargo ship. I got a bad feeling about the job partway through. Boarded the ship to find slaves. Nearly 200. Elves, humans, children even. It was sickening. They paid Castillon to take them away from the Blight. He took their money and sold them into slavery. Even I know that's wrong. Didn't expect that, did you, Guardsman? If getting the relic gets Castillon off your back, then I'll help you retrieve it. I still don't know where it is, but you'll be the first to know if I hear anything. Anyway, thanks for helping me out with Hader. I think I'll tag along for a while. There might be something I could do for you. And I have a room at the Hanged Man if you're looking for company later. And we have another member of our group. She's going to be another rogue, so. But one that's going to focus on melee combat. We didn't get much character development from um, Isabella back in the first game. She was more or less just a character who, who appeared and 
did some crap and then disappeared. Uh, not really that important. Didn't really have that much to do with the storyline. So it's nice to see that they brought this character back and then fleshed her out a little bit more. How she sort of fell out of grace with the people she was working with because Idiot thugs and their gangs always around at night, but there's good coin in getting rid of them. She went and um, her stance she took against this like slavery that is going on now. Uh, slavery is pretty. Uh, widespread around the world. Now, it's it's illegal in Ferelden, but we're not in Ferelden. And it's, um, well, you know. Oh, time for a fight. 